Hi. Um, it's not so much like news of like anything coming out or anything like that, but I um I miss. Ever, did everyone here play Mario Super Mario sixty four? Yes. Very long Some. time ago. Um, what was a button that you pressed the most? You think in that game? The jump End button. End the game. End the game. <laughs> I wow. Like it. Jump. I didn't like it jump. Very much. The jump button. Yeah. Okay. Um, you can't jump. So someone has now beaten the game without pushing that button once. What? 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 Yes. So this is a. <laughs> this is one of my favorite challenges. So. Um, with speedrunning and just in general, video games always have like challenges that the community has made. Yeah. No and hit challenge the backwards, if you yeah, do backwards, the no touch, no, no blah, blah, blah. um, Mario 64 has some of the ones that I'm like the most impressed seeing people do, like the no coin challenge, yeah, mm-hmm. or um, carry a box through the whole level challenge, uh, in no, the, no, what is it called? No power up, no power up challenge, like all that stuff. So this has so this one is one that everyone thought was impossible to do. Yes. Yeah. And it is not. It took 86 hours. <laughs> but a Twitch streamer by the name of Marbler was able to complete this. Um it is important to note that it was not using the Nintendo 64 controller and N64 version of the game. It is impossible that way. However, he used the um, Wii Virtual Console for this game. Oh. No controller rerouting. Oh, he cheated. No, not not in the eyes of this challenge, because the A button is still needed to jump. This is some... He... No. I, I don't know the full extent of exploits or how it was done, um, I had no way to get that information in a reasonable amount of time, considering just the history, or just like the overview of this challenge, is a five-hour video mm. on um, a, a user named Bitsmith's channel. So there's more, there's a lot that goes into this. And it's like, this isn't like an, I don't know if this is an official thing to speedrun.com or anything, but he had, um, this user, I believe, had before gotten it down to using it twice, and the, everyone thought that was the limit, and he's gotten it down to not using it at all. That's, I, I have to see this done. Wild. Like, no. Yeah, I, I wonder if he has the VOD. I don't know. But it is important to understand, like, everyone's shouting cheater. I, I get what y'all are saying, <laughs> but and also, if he's using an exploit that is available in the game, I don't know if that's cheating. He is not mm. modifying the game in any way. Yeah. So Yeah, at least this can defi- get really complicated. There's some definite right. gray area here. Yeah. It it is a gray area, but I mean I can no clip play Mario and beat it in ten minutes if I really wanted to, and that's on the original contr- on the original console. And mind you, I as as someone who's a huge fan of skirting the rules to accomplish things <laughs> I want to do. I I I I'm you bastard. Uh, like, I, I feel as though, I, I don't know, maybe I'm just upset because someone figured out a way to do something that I was like, oh, I could figure that out. Yeah. And so, okay, cool. And this challenge has existed for over 20 years and no one has ever accomplished this. Wow, okay. Which, that I feel is also important for this. Um, there is like, there's all kinds of resources online on how to skip doing things without the A button. Yeah. Um, Bob Mario 511 is someone who has a lot of videos on it, and I believe uh, Marbler mentioned he used a lot of his videos as, like, reference. Yeah. Out of spite, I'm going to go look for more information on this. Like, <laughs> I mean, again, Bismuth on YouTube has a five-hour video talking about this. Bring it on. Or about this topic, so not this. I got a part. lot of whiskey. Let's go. <laughs> apple juice. I mean, yes, yeah, apple juice. Yeah, I, it's just something fun, like a fun little challenge. I, I thought it was cool. Yeah. Okay. I, mm. 